Hey guys, and welcome to a brand new video on my channel. In this video, it's going to be a little bit of a long one, and we're going to be discussing the construction skill, and more importantly, the 4 3 and 3 elements of the construction skill. So we had a bonus XP weekend recently in July, and the one before that was around Feb and March, so my opinion is, is that there's going to be a bonus XP weekend roughly towards the end of October, maybe early November. Now in July, it was the first bonus XP weekend where the frames and the construction XP from upgrading your fort in an AFK and easy method. It's the first time it was ever sort of exposed in a bonus XP weekend. And in terms of XP, it was mad. It was a fully AFK, maybe similar to mahogany tables, but it really was a very low effort skill or method of skill where you could just chill and fully AFK and get one of the highest rates of construction which you've ever been in the game. Now off the back of that, that means that more people will be aware of this method, so the next bonus XP weekend which comes up, frames will be a lot more in demand than they were previously. So because of that, and because we've got a little bit of time, now could be the best time for you to stock up on these frames, whether they are to sell for yourself, use for yourself, or hold on a little bit longer till bonus XP weekend and sell for a major profit. Now in terms of the frames themselves, they have quite a few different tiers, and they upgrade every 10 levels. And this starts with your basic normal logs or normal plank type at level 1. So in terms of the money maker, this is a really good money maker for lower levels, it's whether the lower level ones make profit, the medium levels on whether the medium frames make profit, and the high levels as well is the higher frames may make profit as well. Now there's three elements to the frame. You have the normal turning the logs into the actual planks themselves, which again, the newer planks, there might still be profit in that. I'm not going to check that, but again, you could make profit there. You also have turning those planks into refined planks and you're going to need four of those normal planks going to refine planks and then finally three refined planks to turn into a frame. So to make a frame from planks you're going to need 12 planks in total. So after level 1 we've then got oak at 10, willow at 20 and then so on and so on. Every 10 levels you can upgrade to a new tier frame. After you've done the quest you'll pretty much be at level 5 anyway so you have the ability to do wooden frames. And to start with, wooden frames are probably one of the best ones to make GP from as well. But especially if you start a new account, I believe there's a new 7 day promotion with a Twitch Prime. You can use the frame construction method as your base way to make GP. The Bond account did extremely well making frames throughout its stint. And especially in Season 3, it makes some serious profit with them as well. So that's what this episode is basically going to be. It's similar to how we've done with the Necro Supplies. We're going to talk through the frames from top to bottom, look at the prices, see what's best, see what's worst. And then have a little bit of valuation at the end. So we're going to talk through the whole range of prices. Now these have been dotted throughout the Grand Exchange for the past couple of weeks. Now the necromancy items have gone. So we have spoken about them a little bit during Market Watch. So now I thought it'd be sort of the best time. With a bonus XP weekend possibly looming in a couple of weeks to month. Maybe now's the best time to look at it and see what is good for profit. And what is good to stock off on in terms of planks. So the first one we're going to do is the one at level 1. And that is just your standard plank. So that will buy it. And all I'll be doing, I won't be uh, testing the margins for planks. I will just be instant buying them and then working off the frames from there. Don't want to make this video too long, but then I want to go through enough detail. So I don't think checking the margins for everything is what we really need to be doing. Now the thing is with the refined planks and the frames, something we found out on the last bonus XP weekend is low volume can be major for these. So as we see here, the normal plank we bought for 424 GP. The refined plank, again, will spend a little bit of money for it. Doesn't buy for 100k. So... That is something I will go and test in a bit, and we'll see where we go from there. Tell you what, I'll do it now, and then I'll come back when we've got one. So, for the power of editing, we've gone and made our own refined planks. So, I'll test the margin by just throwing one in to sell now. So, 6.1k is what that's bought for, but as you saw, we tested 100k, and they didn't buy. So, I'm pretty confident I can throw that in. So, I'm glad that's happened, because that can be a bit of a disclaimer, really. So, one thing I did notice during the bonus XP weekend is that even though there was no volume for these refined planks, no one would buy them at a given price. So I'll use an example. So during the bonus XP weekend, I was doing U refined planks. They would sell for a price of 11K. However, you wouldn't be able to buy a refined plank up to 50K. So I would try and sell my refined planks for 45K. They would only budge one at a time with people checking the margins. But then if I put them down towards the 11k mark, they would all sell easily. Whereas I had my offer in at 45k for about a week and I sold about 15. So they are weird where you can have an item which has absolutely no volume on the Grand Exchange, but still doesn't sell due to demand. And then the wooden frame doesn't sell at all, which is even better. So the wooden frame bought for 27k. 
So this will probably not have bought well because they're not really in demand. But however, you saw the money you can make here. Four planks, 1.6k will turn into 6.2k. And then 6.2k times it by three, 18.6, you're then able to turn into 27k. Now, the problem with that is if you've just seen, it's quite hard to do. Um, or at least to get sales because not a lot of people will be buying them. And that's probably why the lower tier of frames are going to be a little bit ropey to start with. But that's why we're here for. We're here to test them all. So oak plank. And again, we've got to a point now where because there's not really been um, a thought for infantry update in a while, the hype's kind of died down a bit. And people have already upgraded their thoughts. Um, you do, you are able to shift frames quite well on an update week or once an update week's been quite relevant to refine oak planks. Although oak seems to be quite good. Yeah, so oak, oak does decent volume of oak by the look of it. Right, so an oak plank, um, 704 GP. So if we times that by four, it's 2.8K. So 2.8K is then transformed to 8.1K on a refined oak plank. And then three of these, 24 point... 5k and you're able to sell it for 43k so that is 17k profit turn into a frame and it's also about 5.7k turn into a fine plank as well so oak at level 20 will make you some very good profit it's such a low construction skill so that's pretty nice so after oak the next here is willow the willow is the first of the newer planks so to price check in the plank is worth doing because i have a feeling there won't be very high in volume so 4.1k for that. A refined willow plank is going to be, there we go, 11k. That's more, that's more like it. So this one, turning the willow planks, admittedly we've had to buy them. It's a pretty high price. Um, you don't make money turning them into frames. Ignore this price because, again, that's a low volume thing. It, you won't sell there. You'll only just get the price check buys um, of people seeing what margin is. So I'd go off this price. So you're not going to make money turning willow planks into refined willow planks. Although, if you make a couple and sell them at that margin, it, it would be worth it, but I don't think you would. And then finally, the Willow Frame, which I don't think will make profit because of the price of the refined planks. There you go. 99k. Actually, to be fair, 74k sell is not too bad either. So if you pick a couple of these up for 11.4k, that's very much worthwhile. You turn 33 35k into 76k, or if you actually turn these into your planks yourself, you can make a bit of money there. I think with um, plank price is going to be 2.5k ish or link. So Willow Logs about 1.5k. Yeah, you'll turn something like 30k into 76. Very decent, actually. Your only problem with Willow, similar to like the first tier log, is low volume. So the next one is Teak. Teak will be quite easy to buy because that was one of the original four before the update of the new planks. 655 for a plank. So having a look here. So Teak plank is 655 GP each. So if we went 2.8k per refined plank, that's actually a decent profit. 12k profit just turning it into a refined plank. You don't make money though turning a refined plank into the frame. So for me, I would sell that as refined planks rather than a frame. But still, really decent profit in that. That is actually not too bad. The next one is maple. And I do believe this will follow the same sort of form as the willow. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Because people don't really make these, they're just isn't volume and if there is volume it's going to be really high on the grand exchange okay let's try 100k so maple will give a miss doesn't even buy for 100k so after maple might be acadia yes so acadia but again similar to willows that's why you it's worth checking all these through checking the margins because there might actually be like ones which are better profit than the high tier ones and that's what this episode is for is to pick out like what really makes money and what is worthwhile it could turn out that if those are really like no volume at all, making maple planks could be one of the best money makers out of a lot. Not that I think it will be because there's no real use for them apart from um, a couple of the upgrades. So 6.9k for a plank. So KDA have all bought just under 7k for a plank. So it's actually not worth turning it into a refined plank and selling it. And to be fair, it's actually not ter worth turning an Acadia plank into a frame either. If you could buy the refined planks and turn into a frame, that is worth it. But that's quite a high price for planks. So depending on the price for logs, what I'm going to do, I'm just going to take a quick pause because after this, we've literally just got you, Magic and Elder left to go. I'm going to make 10 each of these, um, of these tier of logs into planks. 
and I'm going to see if it's sell. So I will be back in a minute. So we are back. I'm just going to put those offers in the Grand Exchange. Now, if these sell, I'll make sure to take a picture and put it on my community tab. So I'm always really interested. And if those maple planks sell, I will be amazed. But again, this just proves how low volume both the sell and the buys are for certain planks for Fraud for free. We had an offering for 100k, it didn't buy. We're selling it 29k and it still won't sell. So, so we've gone through all the lower tier ones. And again, like each tier of log will have profits on a certain thing. And it won't be the same throughout, which is why you need to test margins and work your way through it. So we've just got four left now. So I try and go through them as quick as possible. So we've got mahogany, which will be nice and quick. To be fair, the final three will be quick anyway, because they're more tiered to people who will buy and train through this method of construction. 1.4k for mahogany log as well. It's good to see those prices back up. So a mahogany frame has not, sorry, refined mahogany um, planks, not buying. That's a little odd. So I expected them to buy because they are one of the first tiers of like frames and logs released. In terms of the frame price, the pairing price is 51k. So for me, I wouldn't buy a refined plank for any more than 12k because you still want your profit there and it's quite reasonable as well. Turning 1.5k, so 6k into 12k, again, that's good profit. So that is Mahogany. So you and you was the favorite for the bond account over the bonus XP weekend. Really made some money on that. And actually managed to pick some new planks up quite cheap. Yeah, 960 GP for that. So V should be around, if memory serves me right, 11K. Oh, even better. Uh, 100K. Yeah, 26, right, okay. But if we sell these, what price will they go for? 96, right, okay. And a U frame. It was normally around 60-ish. For whatever reason, the U-frame is like one of them which just doesn't go up in price to where it is. The others are pretty much near where they need to be. 54.5. So yeah, not too bad. So you're going to be roughly 30k. You'll turn that into 55. And the U-plank is so cheap. 12 of those. You're pretty much looking 12k. 12k into 54k. It's just pure profit. Now you'll make profit with all the others up to level 70. But I think from level 70 onwards... You, Magic, and Elder is where you'll really make your profit and money. So, Magic for the second highest one going. 1.5k for a Magic Plank. So, four of those. Well, let's say 1.6. You are going to be looking at 6.4k. 6.4k will turn into just under 16k. So, that's just under 10k profit for the Planks into Refined Planks. And then Refined Planks into a frame. 7-ish k profit. So... Refined planks are better for that, but if you turn your normal magic planks into a frame, there's pretty good profit there anyway. 12 of those, you're just looking under 20k. Under 20k, turn into 52, pretty nice. However, one thing which could be said is if we look at you, you would probably be better than magic. And to be fair, on a bonus XP weekend, I did find out for that to be the case. So finally, the Elder set. So an Elder Plank is going to cost 12.5k. Now these will be pricey because these are probably one of the best construction uh, training methods. And I did it and I loved it. It was just so nice. 52k for a fine plank is a little steep. 12.5k, so 37.5 to 53k. That's 15k profit. Really good. But if you can stretch that out to just under 74k, even better. Um, and that makes me wonder what an Elder Frame is going to cost. Wow, just under 200k. 180. They are very much that price. Wow. So even buying a refined Elder Plank at 74k, you're not going to make the money. You really need to get them at the low ball, 53k, to uh, make a decent shout. However, if you took 12 of these, that's 144k. If you sell it for the high end, that's 50k per frame. But even though like a bonus XP weekend isn't announced, there's, there, these are expensive. Like 200k for an older frame. I bought mine for 80k each. So I did really well there. I got construction quite cheap, which is kind of why I did it. I realized that the older frames were so cheap that I could just sell them mahogany logs and I'd get the same XP from mahogany plug, mahogany plank, just doing the same same thing. But that is Fort for Free Supplies. As you can see, dotted around here, no matter what level you do, there is profit profit all around and you could train construction to 99 now and come out with an absolute fortune off the back of it and if i was to play the new account again that's probably what i'll do is aim for 99 construction nice and trim cape but it will give me a shed load of money to work out as well still very much a highly profitable skill even though not many people do it at the fort now if you're looking for a way to make some xp if you're looking for a way to make some gp which is actually a little bit afk as well it's not fully afk but again you're not intensively like doing this it's very chilled and laid back and I always seem to watch videos while I do it just as a way to like relax and stuff. 
But yeah, really good and a lot of profit throughout. And I wanted to do this video to talk through the profit, what I would do with each set, because with each set of logs, not everything makes the money in the same way. Some are best to sell as refined planks, some are best to sell as planks, and some are best to sell as frames. You need to work out which one you want to do. And from that, you need to work out which one you want to pick to sell as well. So that is that. Now, what I'm going to do, I'm actually going to leave these three items in the Grand Exchange. If they do sell, I'll either put it at the end of this video or I'll make a post on my community tab. Make sure to check out my community tab as well because I always put polls for future content and I want you guys to um, be voting on what you want to see next. But that'll be the end of this one. Sorry, it's a long one. I wanted to make sure to talk through everything possible and like guide you guys through this. Um, and I probably won't make another video on frames again. I'll always refer to this one as the video to watch if I'm talking about frames or doing anything with frames. Now I need to sell all this, which is going to be a pain. But anyway, hope you guys enjoyed. If you have, please give me a like. Please subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys very soon in the next one.